In this perfect situation, the hospital is ready and has practiced this scenario many times before. While the clinical teams are attempting to save as many lives as possible, incident command is in the background, focused on staff, stuff, structure, and systems. They contact supply chain leadership to stock the ED with the extra supplies they may need and available pharmacy team members report to the ED to assist with distributing medications safely but quickly. The inpatient floor and ICU teams are pulling admitted patients up to created space using consult rooms, meeting rooms, and even hallways if needed. Clinical providers all know their roles. Pediatricians and all pediatric specialists are helping where they can either by assisting the ED team in performing life-saving procedures or helping the surgeons in deciding who needs to be operated on first and who should get transferred out. The team works diligently and exhaustingly for the first few hours and then things start to calm. Incident Command has set up a family reunification system and has shared this publicly so that worried families can get accurate information in a timely manner.